So hardwoods are um, an important component of the Piedmont longleaf system. And uh, when we did our initial thinning um, for the restoration, uh, we purposely left um, species like oak and hickory that were present on the site. And uh, last, then last fall, we had a couple of hurricanes come through and uh, we did lose an, a few of those large uh, oaks, especially um, in the hurricanes. These uh, tree falls, as we call them, um, create really interesting microtopographic features in stands like this. Right where we're standing. Right where we're standing, <laughs> yeah. Um, so um, when a, a tree like this is, is thrown over, um, typically as it falls, it'll tip up its root plate containing a large amount of soil, and that's what happened here. Um, of course, in the process, it leaves a large pit, the one we're standing in. And then over time, as um, rain and weather affects this root plate, much of this soil will begin to settle down and it'll form a linear ridge, um, or a mound as it's called. The pit will of course remain. Uh, foresters refer to this as pit and mound topography. And if you walk through any forest in this area, you'll see pits and mounds created at various times in the past. So they're very interesting features.